Welcome back to Let's Play Grand Turismo 4 Part 18. And now we're going to move on to the next special condition event, which is the Ice Arena, easy, at Whistler Ice. Or the... I... whatever. Fuck it. I said something wrong. I don't know what the fuck I said wrong. Let's just fucking start this shit. I already have snow tires, so all ready to go. Now, I'm actually going to change the transfer case to a 50-50 power distribution instead. Because I feel like that might be better for the snow and, like, preventing from spinning out and shit. So I'm going to give it a shot see if I can even tell a difference anyways. So, yep, going against another Delta. In this race, at least. And holy shit, this is bright. Uh, hold up. Let me just do that for this video. So I don't go blind. So, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and try to pass early. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Brake check me, why don't you? Not like it hurt anyways. The penalty. Make my move now. Okay. Yeah, that happened. Okay, I'm spinning out. Hmm. Huh. The hard part about this is that the track is so short and you only have two laps. Set up good for this. Fuck it, hit the wall, whatever. I need to keep the speed up so I can dive bomb him right here. Or not. Hmm. I don't know about this one. I'm gonna have to pull something out of my ass here. Closer than last time. Oh, shit. See if I can actually cut him off. <laughs> Dirty driving, but it worked. Now I just gotta maintain the lead. Snow is a lot more challenging than the dirt, I will say that. And there we go. Pulled that victory out of my ass. Very fast race. This whole video is going to be fast in general. So, yeah. You're probably going to see quite a bit of double uploads because I just want to start plowing through this LP and get those endurance races going. Alright, time for the second and final race of this event. Two laps in the opposite direction. Aha, this time we're going against a Celica GT4. Alright, this is attempt number... I don't even fucking know anymore. This one's proving to be pretty damn challenging. I just have to do that, pretty much, and get around him on the first corner. Ah, uh, that's not gonna work. That will. Okay, will I be able to maintain my lead now? That's, okay, yep. That, that didn't last long. Uh, okay, I made it. Finally. For now. He's just gonna pass me again. This shit's actually really... fucking tough. Alright. I'm gonna try to gain some ground on him. Take it easy through here, because he fucking nails this. Every single time. The AI for rally events are just insane. But on Tarmac, they're basically Hell and Keller. And they also don't get penalties, unlike you. 
Even if they hit you, like that. I'm just taking it easy. Making sure he can't get around. Uh, I'm a little too wide right here. Oh no. He's gonna go on the inside. Outside, now. Actually, judging by the map, he's a little bit further back than that. And there we go. Holy fuck, that took several tries, but finally made it. Christ. So, yippee ki -yay. Snow challenges are more challenging. Fun fact, if I haven't said that already. So, cool. Gonna get a replay thumbnail and collect the prize money and the prize car. Alright, 5,000 credits. And, of course, like every other event ever, the prize car. And the prize for today's event... Toyota RSC. Fucking ugly as fuck, but... Fuck it. Also, it's the street version of the RSC Rally Car, which is the one I go after in the Cosa de Amalfi event. Oh, hey, look at that. Sarth 2. Now I can do some top speed tests. So, cool, I guess. I don't fucking know. Even though the test course exists, exists for that reason, but whatever. So, uh, yeah. 9.1% complete now. Where's that Toyota RSC? There you go. So yeah, kind of fucking hideous, but whatever. Can't sell for anything, sadly. But the RSC Rally Raid car is this much. So, cool. Anyways, blah blah blah, stay tuned for more GT4.